guys. I thought I'd show you something uh, kind of fun this morning. I've got a little uh, little thing uh, to press in these little nut certs here. These are uh, a little part that's available on McMaster car. And uh, what's nice about them is if you press them into uh, plastic, then you get a steel, stainless steel uh, thread, which is, you know, a lot better than threading into plastic. Um, but what I've done here is uh, taken a, a smoothie board here. This is an Aztec X5 Mini from Panacat Devices. Uh, and I just wired in the thermistor and a hot end. And you can see there's a, uh, it's actually running at uh, 231 degrees. I'm working with ABS. And, um, you know, that's just a box of parts. And here's another thing that was in the parts bin. This is a Ubis hot end. And I've just uh, chucked it up there. I put a... Uh, uh, I put a little nub up there so that I could chuck it up, and then uh, the one thing I had to do was machine this uh, this hot end tip here so that it would go into um, uh, into the M5 opening right there. So let me just show you what this thing does. Okay, so it's a just a drill press, trusty Harbor Freight product, and then we'll just uh, we're just turning this down here, and it goes right there. And you wait for a few seconds while the heat transfers into the nut cert. I don't know if that's focusing or not. But... And then as soon as it gets the temperature, it'll start to press in. There it goes. And we're almost there. And done. And out. And there you can see. Kind of overdid that one right there. I might have to change the shape of the uh, uh, the nozzle there so it doesn't have a flat top on it. That's pretty easy to do a little step up there. But you can see I've already done these. Um, and it's kind of weird because in order to get that angle, you have to hold it at a, at a weird angle. So what I did is I made these little fixtures here. And then that, if I can get this in one handed, that's a little hard to do. Um, come on, Steve. What are you doing? Oh, there we go. Okay. There we go. And then that holds that holds it perfectly level. So and I have another fixture for the other side, so you flip it over and do that. And then you just set that up there. And there you've got it. So now I'm able to press fit all of those uh, perfectly uh, straight in. And it's a lot better than my old version, which was uh, to use the, uh, the old uh, uh, torch. Uh, to heat up those little nuts and then uh, you know put them into a screw and try to press them in by hand and that just wasn't working very well but this works really well and um, and when you when you line up the holes uh, put it down for here for a second and you can see that you get nice perfect alignment to the uh, water jet cut parts there you go that's a little tip for you guys if you're trying to do more permanent uh, solutions to your to your threading needs into plastic. These little things from McMaster are the real deal. They work great. Have a great day.